We're filling you in on the best ways to add years to your life. Sometimes that means working against our genes. And Christine has a question about that. My mother has high blood pressure. Several of her siblings have had high blood pressure. One died of a stroke, one had a heart attack. My grandfather had high blood pressure. My biggest fear is that I will develop high blood pressure and possibly have a heart attack. It really scares me because I don't want to leap that way. <laughs> I would like to find out how I fit into my family ties as far as heart conditions, um, heart ailments, diabetes. I would definitely like to know what I can do to help prevent those things from happening to me. Well, Christine is here with us. Welcome to the show, Christine. Hi. And I'm glad you asked this question because you're taking your health into your own hands. And this is something many people face with a family history of health problems. You need to be armed with information. So, this is all about getting tested. So there's actually this new type of cholesterol test. It's called the VAP test. And it can give a more accurate, individualized picture of your heart disease, even diabetes risk. This is what Christine went to have done. And Christine, I have your results. Oh, good. I'm, I'm curious to see how they turned out. Your cholesterol levels looked beautiful. Oh, wonderful. Thank you. They really did. Thank you. Right where you want them to oh, be. So that, that doesn't mean you don't happy. need to get them rechecked at some point in the future, but right okay. now, cholesterol is not a problem Oh, for that's you. such good news. Thank you. <laughs> and because I'm not a true expert in this area, we have Dr. Michael Cobble on the phone to tell us a little bit more about the VAP test. Welcome to the show, Dr. Cobble. Thanks, Dr. Stork. I'm excited to be here. I think the exciting thing about this expanded lipid profile is that it's more comprehensive, measuring 20 cholesterol issues, and it can identify hidden cholesterol problems that increase your risk for serious illness. And whether it's very low density VLDL, what Dr. Cobble does and other doctors who test this cholesterol profiles, they're figuring out if you have high cholesterol that's going to stick in your arteries. That's the kind of cholesterol that gums up your arteries and can lead to a heart attack and stroke. And meanwhile, Dr. Cobble, you're, you're still testing for HDL, the high density lipoprotein, which is the more you have, the merrier. Yeah, we still check for that good cholesterol. It's, I call it the uh, snow plow of the arteries since I live in Salt Lake City, Park City. But some people, if they live in a dry environment, they could call it the pooper scooper of the arteries. But <laughs> <laughs> the HDL is that good cholesterol that's there to pick up the bad cholesterol and then remove it from the arteries so it doesn't accumulate. And briefly, when are you recommending to your patients to get a test like this done? I think uh, people with a strong family history should be tested very early in life, otherwise age 45 or age 55. And then you can get these results and you can take action in your life to improve your cholesterol numbers. Dr. Cobble, thank you so much for explaining that to us. Thank you. And Christine, you feel good, right? Now I you know. I feel fabulous. Well, you look great. Thanks so much for coming thank on the so show. Thank you so much Best of luck me. to you.